And just like that, the weekend's over. Happy Monday, rise and grind. Taking a quick break from editing to update my holiday streakers activity. I'm not going to get into all the details, but basically Holiday Streakers is this program slash organization where you donate money and commit to doing 15 minutes of exercise every day between Thanksgiving and Christmas. And so you actually log your activity on their website. I've joined a team with a bunch of my Insta BFFs and I it really has encouraged me to work out or get moving on the days where I would literally do nothing. I'm like, okay, I can at least do 15 minutes. If that's doing my squats and push-ups, if that's dancing a little bit, if it's cleaning around the house, it's just being intentionally active and it's really cool. And I really like to see everyone's progress and you know, comment on all their pictures and things like that. It's a really cool experience. I saw them doing it last year on Instagram and I was like, ah, oh, that looks like fun, but I won't join in. And then Chella, AKA Footy Turn Sleevey, specifically sent me an invitation and I was like, oh my God, I guess I have to sign up now. I mean, it's for charity. So I signed up and I'm really pleased. You get a free t-shirt, which is awesome. And I mean, I'm definitely gonna be doing it from now on. I'll put the link in the description below. Um, just, you know, of course it's kind of too late to sign up this year, but like keep it in mind for next year. Going with blue raspberry today. It is probably my third favorite flavor behind black cherry and pink lemonade, but it's still really good. And of course it's better than grape. And you know what? I'm being a grape hater. Grape's not that bad. It's just not my favorite, but I don't like grape flavored anything. So I was <laughs> definitely being unfair. <laughs> You're being ridiculous. Hi, Maddie. Hi, Maddie Angel. Hey guys, I am hungry. Like I, I've already had an Atkins bar today. I just didn't film it because I was like, I would just rather eat it. So I ate the Atkins bar at like 9.05 while I was watching Keto Connects Live. And now it's 11.05 and I still want to eat more. So I have fixed my egg roll in a bowl. I topped it with sesame seeds. Like, oh my gosh, it's going to be great. What I did not top it with was sriracha. And I didn't top it with sriracha because the sriracha is at the shop, guys. Like, I am devastated. So that means I will not have sriracha until Wednesday. And life has no meaning. So I'm going to eat this. Got an ice drink. Egg roll in a bowl, TV on a couch, back to work. Okay guys, so semi big news. I have decided at the advisement of my doctor to have surgery in January to remove the damaged portion of my bowel. So as we've already covered in an earlier vlogmas, I have Crohn's disease, which is an autoimmune inflammatory bowel disease. So when I was hospitalized and diagnosed in 2015, my doctors were all surprised that I had never had any symptoms before because according to what they discovered on the colonoscopy, they said that my damage was consistent with like scarring and inflaming that had been occurring for five years. And they just kept asking like, are you sure you felt fine? So you haven't had any symptoms ever? And I was like, dude, clearly if I had symptoms, I would have been here. I'm here now because I had symptoms for the first time. So like, even though I 
got on track with my gastroenterologist. I've been taking my medicine this whole time. It just seems that a portion of my bowel is too far gone and is no longer responding to the medicine. And that's why I have been hurting recently. So, and by recently, I mean like six months, but still. Uh, we always knew it was a possibility and a probability, but they said as long as I wasn't feeling bad, then we didn't have to worry about it. Well, the time has come where I'm feeling bad and now we have to worry about it. And right now I'm on my way to the doctor the surgeon's office to have kind of like a pre-surgery appointment. Hello, hello, hello. Ugh, I just left the doctor. It's getting too real. Like, they gave me like the time I was supposed to show up on the day of my surgery. They gave me the bowel prep that I'm gonna take and how I have to be on a liquid diet and blah, 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 and shower with antibacterial soap. Oh, I don't want to do it, mommy. I don't want to do it. Oh my gosh, mom. She said there's a 5% chance that I'll have to have an ostomy, which doesn't even sound like a real word. That's where they have to divert my waist away from my rectum for a short period of time. Like I would have a stoma in a colostomy bag. I don't want to happen, mommy. Okay, so I just checked the mail and I got a bunch of fun stuff. The first one is a Christmas card from my BFF, Chella, AKA Footy Turn Sleevey. Look at the back. Like she even has one of those little wax presser things that remind me of Harry Potter. Like how classy. Oh, thank you, Chella. Oh, this is so nice. Like I'm not a card person at all. At least like I don't send them, but boy, are they a joy to receive. So thank you so much. Next, I wonder who this is from. Oh, you guys. First of all, bottle opener. I am so excited. Look, it has zip fizz on it. Oh my gosh, how fancy is that? Not too familiar with how to like use these. I don't drink beer or anything like that that would require a bottle opener, but I'm pumped. Definitely gonna use it tomorrow. Also, look what they sent me. A, a zip fizz water bottle, what? What? I'm definitely gonna be using this from now on to shake up my zip fizz. I mean, this is great. I am pleased. Oh my God, look how like precise everything is. Like, oh my God. Ooh, guys, this was the first time that I almost just like went to sleep without signing off at all. I was just like cutting off all the lights and everything. And I was like, oh, vlogmas. Overall, it was a good day in terms of work productivity, in terms of food, in terms of Ugh, my doctor's appointment, so scary, but it's okay, it's okay. I got some awesome mail, I'll watch some awesome television, so I'm calling today a win. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. I make weekly meal preps, weekly what I eat Wednesdays, and monthly weigh-ins. You can also find me on Instagram, at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks, and I'll see you tomorrow.